Yo, what's up guys? In today's video, I'm going to show you how to make your PC games run better. So let's get straight into the video. First thing we're going to do is open up our Windows settings by clicking on the start and settings. Go to system, display, select whatever resolution you want to select. Go to advanced display settings and select your max refresh rate available to you. Uh, then click apply and your screen might black out for a few seconds, but it's going to be back. Um, go to graphics settings and th for example if you're playing CSGO I'm giving an example just select CSGO go to options and go select high performance uh, click OK hardware accelerated GPU scheduling turn it on because it as it says reduces latency and improves performance you'll need to restart your PC to have effects for your changes to have effects so yeah we're gonna restart it later go to notifications and actions um, turn it off Turn uncheck all of those three boxes, focus assist, turn it off, uncheck all of those four, power sleep, additional power settings like high performance, storage, and turn on storage sense, um, temporary files, delete temporary files by selecting the, that you want to delete. You don't need to delete your downloads folder, so if you don't want to delete it, just do not select it, press remove files like this, and that's it. Next thing you're going to do is go to tablet, select never use tablet mode, multitasking, go to snap windows, turn it off, show suggestions in your timeline, turn it off, um, share across devices, turn it off, clipboard, turn it off, remote desktop, turn it off, go to about right now, uh, press advanced system settings, go to settings, uh, in the visual effects, select adjust for best performance, then select custom. Check smooth edges of screen fonts as shown thumbnails instead of icons, click apply, go to advanced, uh, adjust the best performance of programs, select programs, go to change, uh, uncheck automatically manage the pa paging file size for all drives unselected, for your fastest drive, SSD drive, select system and size, so click select, for the other drives, select no paging file, click set, click ok, ok. Um, data execution prevention, turn on the default programs and services ex except those I select and click apply, ok, ok, restart later, ok, next thing we're going to do is right click on the startup, go to the device manager, um, uh, spread up system devices, turn off high precision event timer, that's totally unnecessary, you don't need it, it just ruins up your performance, next thing you're going to do is um go to type go on the start type ms config then go to boot um select no gui boot and timeout you can select it from 15 to 30. uh the best option for you guys if you're watching this video is from 20 to 25 so make sure to put like 20 here next go to the advanced options numbers of processors select the max number right here click ok click apply and ok exit without restart Next thing, go to services, go to the start type services. Uh, by pressing uh, control and uh, ha, uh, you can search for the services. So let's get started. Um, type sysmain, disable it like this. Properties, right click properties, disabled, okay. Disable offline files, disable parental controls, disable Xbox. Everything related to Xbox, disable Windows Search right here, um, disable everything that's related to Smart Card, disable Packs, disable Prince Puller, disable Game DVR, uh, go to disable, right click disable, okay, okay, uh, never mind. So, yeah, that shall be it for the services part. Next thing you're going to do. Go to this PC, right click on your C drive, go to properties, go to disk cleanup, do a quick disk cleanup. Uh, okay, okay. While it's uh, cleaning up our files, go on the start type CMD, go run as administrator. You need a calculator for this. For example, if you have 8 gigabytes of RAM, type 8x1024. And this is the number you should put in this command vc edit slash set increase user va and number right here. I have 60 gigabytes of RAM, so I'm gonna type 16x 1024 and I'm gonna type this number right here. So that shall be it. Make sure you rename the program as administrator, otherwise, it won't work. 
so yeah next thing you're going to uh do is you i'm gonna leave the link of those two down below in the description run up cc cleaner open it up wait for it to to open up when it opens up it goes to custom clean uh you'll get a free trial if you downloaded this for the first time you'll get free trial so you can update your drivers right here and uh optimize your performance and let's do a quick custom clean uh by the way you can select what you want it to clean like here like from advanced from windows downloads from system from internet explorer from mesh chromium next thing you're going to do go to registry and scan for issues mm, wait for it to finish uh review selected issues no don't back up it don't back it up so yeah next thing open malware bytes mm. yeah by the way uh let's get back on the services part of the video uh when you disable this in the in this services uh, tool program however you want to call it make sure you disable it here as well because otherwise it won't work so yeah uh scan start scanning while it's scanning uh we, we can do another thing is go to the um go to the go on the start and type check for updates and make sure your windows is up to date so yeah that should be it um i'm going to leave the link of those two down below in the description so make sure to check it out and download it those are the best tools for cleaning up your free disk space in your pc so yeah if you have discord uh just go user settings go to voice and video go to Hardware Excel find hardware acceleration and turn it off. Um, it's gonna help you your Discord run better and all of that. By the way, I'm going to leave the link of my Discord server down below if you wanna join. I'd appreciate that, it supports me. Um, next thing we wanna do is go on the um, go on the start, type run, tap temp, type temp, delete everything that's in here, type run, type percent temp percent delete everything that's here as well or we'll skip the programs you cannot delete okay as you can see this small bytes is done i have no threats for my pc so it's good um next thing go run type prefetch and delete everything that's here as well so yeah and delete it from the recycle bin that shall be it next thing if you have an nvidia control panel open it up so we're just gonna run quick through it, adjust image settings with preview, use my preference emphasizing, move it all the way to the performance, click apply, manage 3D settings, and image scaling off, ambient occlusion off, anisotropic filtering off, anti-aliasing, FXA off, gamma correction on, uh, anti-aliasing mode off, background application frame rate, max frame rate off, to the G GPUs all and select your GPU that you're using, DSR factors off, low latency mode on, max frame rate off, multi-frame sampled AA, MFA, uh, uh, leave it at off, OpenGL, uh, GDI compatibility, uh, auto, OpenGL rendering GPU, and select your GPU, power management mode, prefer maximum performance, prefer refresh rate, highest available, shadow cache size, I prefer putting it on 100 gigabytes because it works the best for me. Uh, I have a lot of free disk space on my D drive, so yeah. Texture filtering and isotropic sample option on uh, negative load bias allow texture filtering quality, high performance, trinilear optimization on, threaded optimization on, triple buffering off, vertical sync off, virtual reality pre rendered frames. Uh, one virtual reality variable uh, rate sub sample turn it off volcano opengl present method auto and that should be it and if you have any specific program you can add this edit right here click add and and it's going to copy all of these settings from the global settings so so yeah for example i want to select i don't know csgo and that's it click apply and that should be it next thing we're going to we're going to do is just um go to the task go to right click here task manager start up disable everything that you don't need to run up with when your pc boots up so it's an important step 
so make sure you do that. Go on the start, type background apps, turn them all off, you don't really need them because don't let apps run in the background, it's gonna affect your performance a lot. Uh, go on the start tape game mode settings, turn on game mode, uh, right here go to Xbox game bar, turn it off, uncheck this, and that should be it. Um, just wait a little. I repeat, I'm going to leave the link of those two down below of C Cleaner and Malware Bias down below in the description, so you can just you know download them and do the thing I did. So yeah, this is it for this video, guys. See you in the next one. Um, if I helped you in any possible way, feel free to like, share this video, and subscribe to my channel. I love you all, guys. Thank you for your support. I hope this video helped you. Also, I'm going to leave the link of my Discord server down below in the description if you want to join. So, yeah. See you in the next video, guys. Peace.